Hey 22 MLSers, it's another version of 22U. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of 22U. This is about the thin shade ready window on our MLS. So we're gonna be tearing this apart. So here's the box, here's the instructions, and here is the window. Not much to it, just a set of instructions and the window. So the instruction manual has lots of different versions. Ours is pretty much the snap-in version, and it's the first version that you're gonna see. There's not much to it. It's just got a top and a bottom and it's rubber banded together. They snap in really easy, and this install video is gonna be longer than it takes you to install this. So here's the snap-in frame. That's what we have on the MLS. Just follow those simple instructions, pretty simple. So here is the little tabs that you're gonna to need to play with on this window. Pretty simple. Flip them open. The ones on the bottom flip one way. And the ones on the top, they flip the other way. Why, I don't know. Okay, so they just are kind of stringy and boingy. So at the shaded part, you just snap on the upper part and it just slides in at a kind of a 45 degree angle. And you push up and you just flip the little latches and that's all that holds this thing in. On the bottom, it does the same thing, except it's a little bit more odd because the little latches really don't hold on too much. But that's all it does, up and down, whoopee. All done. Now we're gonna go over the RV screen door crossbar. A little bit more complicated, you will need a drill and a eighth inch drill bit because you're gonna be drilling into the screen door. So you wanna make sure that you've got this in the right place. Not much to this, you get a package of screws, you get the template. I didn't use the template, I just used some blue painters tape on the door. You get the crossbar, it comes with these two plastic ends. And don't worry about the size because this is a universal fit. So it just slides back and forth. You figure out how much you're gonna need and then you just screw in the ends. You don't need to cut the aluminum rod at all. But this aluminum rod, if you did need to cut it, it's pretty thin, but you don't need to for the MLS. So there's two screws for each plastic end. So here's your instructions. Pretty simple to follow. The big thing to do is to make sure that this thing is level. And I pretty much just follow the, the, uh, the lines of the crossbar in the middle. But one thing you want to make sure that you are not doing when you install this is screw into the crossbar. The crossbar right here is what you want to avoid screwing directly into. That latch or that slide slides back and forth. And if you put a screw right in there, you're going to prevent that thing from closing completely or opening completely. So make sure that you don't put any screws in there so that you're little cover there can slide back and forth very easily. And this is what it looked like after it's been installed. And again, I just eyeballed this, so it's pretty easy. So thanks again, and we'll see you on the next 22U.